What's up everyone, this is Cybernaut, and today we're going to be opening up to uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! at the Dark Side Dimensions Movie Packs Gold Edition for you guys. So yeah, these are basically special editions for the movie packs, and also they're all gold cards. So yeah, it's kind of a cool set. I I'm kind of glad now they actually have these, because at first I remember when they first came out these, I was like, why would you, I mean, because they didn't really add anything besides the promo cards, really. But uh, now since Dark Side Dimension packs are actually kind of hard to find, these are a little bit easier to find now, too. So, let's go on ahead, open these up, see what we can get. Because I still like a lot of these cards from this set. Also, here's different promo cards you can get. You get a Dark Magician, Blue Eyes, you know, one or the other. And also, you have a Cubic Monster and, was it Crystal Dragon? I think that's right. So, let's open this up. Maybe we'll get, you know, one of each of the promos, and I can just show that way. But yeah, again, a Blue Eyes Alternative Dragon would be amazing out of these now. Those have definitely spiked in price lately. If I can get, like, an original... You know, Dark Side of pack, I'm definitely going to try to do an opening on that. So first up, we have the Cubic Monster, and also Dark Magician. So yeah, they are extremely shiny. <laughs> it's like, was it Gold Secret Rare or something? What they called it? Some along those lines. Here's our packs, which I still think these packs are like some of the coolest looking ones. Basically just a movie poster, but they just look awesome. So yeah, everything in this is holographic, obviously, too. So we have Dimension Guardian, a Chaos Form. That's definitely good to get right now, too. That's one of the cards that's kind of gone up in price lately. Uh, Magical Contract Door. Then we have a Dimension Mirage, and also a Dragon's Fighting Spirit. So yeah, Chaos Form. We'll put that at the top. That's yeah, that's actually like a I don't know four three dollar card, something like that. Now it's pretty awesome. Hope you bring out Chaos and Max, so can't go wrong with that. Oh, there we go. We actually have another Dark Magician then. Yeah, you can actually get it in the set too, which is kind of funny they did that. But yeah, obviously Dark Magician. Then we have a Crimson Nova Trinity. That's cool. Cubic Karma. Assault Wyvern. And we also have a Oracle Mahad. That's cool looking. Cubic Karma is probably one of the better cards to get from that too. And last pack for our first one. Yeah, Cubic Monsters always get a little bit of hype. Oh, there we go. Okay, here's a really good card from this. Blue Eyes, a Chaos Max Dragon. Now, that is awesome. One of my favorite cards, too. Probably my favorite ritual monster lately, so that looks amazing. I like that as Gold Rare, too, by the way. I don't know why. I think that looks awesome, though. Uh, Lord Guy, the Fierce Knight, Pandemic Dragon. Then we have another one of Oracle Mahad and Deep Eyes White Dragon. For a second, I thought that was alternative when I saw like the edge of that because it looks really close to it. But yeah, unfortunately not. But we got Chaos Max and its Ritual Spell. So, not bad. Now for the second one. What can we get on this one? You pretty much get a Blue Eyes Alternative. You've, you've easily paid for one of these boxes. I mean, that's for sure. It's like 25 bucks last time I checked. Something along those lines. All right, we have a uh, Crystal Dragon and a uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon. So yeah, we got all the promo cards you can get then. That's cool. I kind of like the Blue Eyes White Dragon that's in this Gold Secret Rare, even though it's like really bad overkill. I feel like on the on the holographic, it still looks pretty cool. Now for our other packs though, what can we get? Now well, we got Dark Horizon. That's cool looking. If I can get to focus there, we have a uh, Berry Magician Girl, Magician's Defense. Then we have Neo Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. That looks awesome. I still like that card, too. And also a Dimension Mirage. You know what? I'm going to put that to the top. Yeah, Blue Eyes definitely got a lot of support in this set. And we have another one of Magician's Defense. I think we got that already. Or we've been getting a lot of Magician cards, so that's awesome. Another uh, Blue Eyes uh, Chaos Max Dragon. I know for sure we got another one of those. Also Oracle Mahad, again. Cubic Karma. Like I said, that's good. And also uh, Final Gas for our other card, too. I think that's how you pronounce that. I always want to say Gios or whatever, like the like the anime code Gios. And uh, last pack. What can we Can we end with the Blue Eyes Alternative Dragon? I'll say it like that. Let's see, because obviously we're going to get a hollow unless we get the weirdest pack ever. Well, we got a fusion. A cubic fusion. And that is uh, Crimson Nova Trinity. He looks awesome. Also, we have uh, Blade uh, Gruta the Cubic Beast. Gold Gadget, which is pretty cool. It's actually in the gold rare. Also, we have Unification of the Cubic Lords and Final Gas. Again, I think I'm saying that right. I could be saying that wrong. So, yeah, there we go. That's the opening. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Just something kind of random, really. And, I mean, I got two of Chaos Max, so 
that was pretty much worth it to me. And also even Chaos Form. Like I said, the Ritual Spell is actually kind of uh, pricey these days. And even Chaos Maxes too. So I still think they're worth picking up because, like I said, the original movie packs are very hard to find now. And, or, you know, if you do find them, they're a little bit pricier now. And uh, I'm at least glad that we actually do have these. Although I still wish that they would have just had maybe like the promo cards be gold. And then they were still like the Ultra Rares. Just because I kind of like the Ultra Rare look on a few of these cards a little bit better. But on some of them too, I kind of like the Gold Rare better too. Like Chaos Max... I kind of actually like it as a gold rare. I don't know. That, that's kind of a tough one. But, yeah, just let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Which cards do you like better as the gold rare or ultra rare? And also, what are the openings you guys want to see in the future? Of course, like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! openings and other Yu-Gi-Oh! related videos. And, of course, I will. Catch you guys later. See ya.